2018, I've ridden a motorcycle every day and I've made a video every day to hashtag 365 motorcycle. This is a surprising week. Four days of not riding a Honda. Yikes! Man, we're back. Yep, yep. Uh, today is Monday, the 17th of September, and I am yawning, but I'm also heading home from work. I'm uh, riding Mrs. Smith's Ducati Multistrada. Why? Because, uh, well, uh, a few reasons. Because it was in the front of the garage, because Mrs. Smith rode it yesterday, and uh, it didn't get ridden too much last month, so I figured, why not, right? Um, uh, kills me not to ride Hondas every day, but uh, I like this bike. It's pretty fun. So, yeah, uh, I don't know. Crappy day today at work. Uh, you know, too much work, too much nonsense. On top of it, I was uh, I got a new hard drive and Windows 10 installed on my computer, so it was pretty much just nonstop uh, issues with things not working properly, which is not really great for workflow management if you have a lot of things to do and things aren't working as you anticipated uh other thing i'm annoyed about today is uh well i'll yeah, spill the dirt man uh yeah uh we had a shooting five days ago i think a homicide and it's pretty close to my house you know uh up at a store it seemed like it uh might have been gang related and today we had another shooting pretty close to my house actually at the uh pet boys i drive by quite a bit you'll see it in the in my videos either coming home or, or leaving home it's probably a few miles from my house and uh it's also a pet boys i go to and to, to make it worse uh two officers were shot and uh one got killed so uh just gonna leave my commentary at that I was thought about uh, rep bombing those people over there because uh, they probably just bought that house. <laughs> hey, that'd be funny. Hey, welcome to the neighborhood. Ah, uh, yeah, let's see what other rants I could rant about. Uh, my neighbor, my neighbor, my new neighbor, man. Pool is green. Green. Uh, I was doing yard work. They have this crazy dog that tries to jump over the fence and bite you and it does it on this on the public side too and i was looking through the fence and uh yeah their pool's green i mean we're not talking hey it's got a little bit of algae in it it's like it is green brown like like a freaking pond and i'm like oh my god man what a uh what a health concern man so i don't know probably time to move man that's all i could say so all right, got to let it go. I also said I'm not going to drink beer during the week, so uh, it's going to be tough, tough day today because I'm already uh, fired up about a lot of, a lot of things. So. All righty, well, I guess that's that for the check-in. And with that, peace out. And we're back. Yep, yep, today should be the 18th of September. I am definitely sure it is a Tuesday. I'm relatively sure that cage is not going to pull out and kill. Uh, yeah, and I'm riding home from work. Almost forgot to record today. I was in pretty uh, deep thought, but now that I think about what I was thinking about, I don't really know what I was thinking about. So, kind of odd. Yeah, so I'm uh, riding a Multistrada today, and. Uh, I'll tell you, even though I'm a Honda guy, and even though this bike has a lot of quirks, I actually really like this bike. Uh, and the clutch, this throttle snatchy, the clutch is sharp, engaging. When you whack the throttle hard, the front end gets all light duty on you. But uh, yeah, when I ride it for a while, I like it. I think because the bike's got a lot of character. That was the theme of what I was saying. It's definitely the uh, most character rich bike in our garage that's for sure it's a uh I mean, it's a small v-twin but uh still pretty pretty mean v-twin it's got termy exhaust on it uh so it sounds mean as uh mean as hell meaner than that bike that uh just rode by skull cap dude I'd rather be riding this thing for shizzle so 
Yep, yep. And uh, I don't know, Mrs. Smith was talking about getting rid of this bike because uh, for all the reasons. Look at this a-hole. Jesus Christ. Almighty. I can't believe that lady pulls in front of me and then is looking the other way. I should have went in there and read of the ride act, but uh, about better than that. It's the same guys yesterday coming home, so let's be leaving at the same time. All right, so yeah, Mrs. Smith, uh, you know, she doesn't ride as much as me. She's got four bikes, and she's a bunch of bikes that I have that she could ride. So she's thinking about uh, actually getting rid of this bike. And it's part of me, it's like, yeah, you know, do what she needs to do. But there's part of me that'll actually miss this bike if it wasn't, uh, if it wasn't in the garage. Uh, yeah, that's what I'll, uh, that's all I'll say, so. You know, and I hear people say this now, and I, and I, I don't agree with what they're saying. You know, they say Honda makes a bunch of, uh, you know, benign bikes. There's not something that's really exciting anymore, and I, I almost have to agree with that, that statement nowadays, you know. Honda's really not making very thrilling bikes. They, they make a lot of cool bikes still, don't get me wrong, but they're not, like, super thrilling, and, uh, bike is pretty entertaining and I'd probably say any Ducati is probably uh, fairly uh, fairly fun as it goes so yep yep I'll uh, we'll get through here split off with this guy alright well I think this is the same bike as yesterday I'm not sure Alright, well with that I will say pop pop peace out and we're back. Yep, 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 yep. So today is the 19th of September. Yep, yep. Headed home from work, riding the duck, uh, nice weather. That's pretty much the drill. So so yeah, I'm uh you know, uh, months back, I was like, I don't know if I want to record every day, and uh, you know, and then I said, ah, stick it out, get get through it, right? And uh, you know, now it's uh, kind of mid Septemberish, and I'm having those same feelings. I mean, it's getting it's getting to be pretty challenging to get these uh, you know, these vids done, and <laughs> running my mouth like I'm doing now doesn't help. But I think what I'm going to start doing is maybe during the week. You know, is try to pick maybe one day to really do like a reasonable recording, and hopefully that'll be a weekend ride because that'll be a little bit more enjoyable. And then uh, during the week, just do quick check-ins. You know, because my point is to uh, <laughs> document every day that I've ridden, not be uh, marvelous, marvelous uh, in entertaining the masses. So. Uh, I think that's going to be my strategy. Again, I'd ask folks what they think, but these videos are so far behind posting, the year will probably be uh, probably be over. So, all right. Well, uh, yeah, I said I'm riding the duck again, and I, uh, you know, me and Mrs. Smith were talking. She's talking about unloading the duck, and uh, I mean, dare I say this, man? I'd, I'd almost, uh, I'm almost to the point like I'd, uh, I'd rather get rid of the hawk. I I love the Hawk, but uh, this is a V-Twin, and uh, yeah, I mean the great thing about this bike the, is that it has a full set of luggage on it. It's got it's got side cases and a top box. Man, the downside is it's a Ducati. It's not a Honda. So coming to those uh, coming to coming to uh, deal with those terms might be uh, might be tough. So all right. Again, uh, I'll see how it goes if I start doing shorty short check-ins and then try to do one good ride recording. So, all right, well, with that, thanks for watching. Ride red. At least think about riding red when you're riding a Ducati. And peace out. And we're back. Yep, yep, today is the 20th of September it is a Thursday and uh, yeah from what I remember I'm getting pretty close to having a uh, hundred days left of this year I don't know exactly when day uh, 265 is but I feel like from processing vids and looking at the calendar I'm, I'm uh, 
getting close. So uh, this is probably the earliest I've been to work in a while. I've been working late and had late meetings and training and stuff. So I've been going in a lot for. Geez, that was a terrible run there by a cage. I've been going in for uh, you know like 7:30, and this is the first day probably in a little while I'm going in for seven. And uh, yeah, it's it's it's. I mean, obviously this happens every year, but surprising to me uh, how dark it is. You know, just how a week difference, weeks time can make such a difference with how dark it is going in. And uh, yeah, I guess it'll get better because uh, we'll be changing the clocks back pretty soon. So instead of it being, you know, say. 6.30, now it'll be 5.30, and it'll be starting to get brighter, so that'll help out, but uh, yeah, I'm not a big fan of uh, changing, the, changing the box back, you know, honestly, I don't know why. It's kind of silly in a way, in my opinion, like, who are we fooling, we're just pretending it's a, you know, different time. Couldn't people just adjust their schedules as, as needed, but, but anyway, I think Arizona did away with it, <coughs> out of all the things they vote on in California. I always wish that would be one of them. So. All right, well, uh, again, riding the riding the dragon again today. I don't know if I said that in this clip because it's my third take of this, so I didn't like the first two. Uh, yeah, it looks like it's gonna be a uh, probably an all Ducati week. I might, uh, I might tomorrow take the. Uh, I'm not supposed to be working tomorrow. It's my day off, but I got a meeting. But uh, I might go to the OHV park after that. So maybe I'll take Norm or or 250. And so, all right. Well, I guess I'll leave it at that. Uh, peace out. Well, don't let my comments scare you. I'll always be a Honda fan. I'll always be riding red. <laughs>